Hey there, comic book friends and fiends. It's Rob here in front of the Great Wall of Comics. It's October, and it's time for our BAM Mystery Comic Box. So UPS was just at the door, dropped off my BAM Comics mystery box. Uh, so this box, again, guys, this is uh, a $79 subscription box. But every single month, you get a graded, signed comic book, plus a raw c copy, plus a mount for hanging and displaying your comics on the wall. Um, so far, I've been very happy with what I get. Uh, again, when you think about uh, the cost of the comics, signatures, grading, everything else, it's pretty much a fair $79 for a signed uh, 9.8 comic is fair. Uh, only the first month where we actually guaranteed a 9.8. Otherwise, it's been like 9.6 or better. Um, I've only received 9.8s. I've heard rumors that a few people have gotten others, but we'll take a look and see. Um, I'm not sure what this month's theme was um, I've been reading rumors that the next month's theme is Spider-Man and um, that potentially they're going to be switching from CBCS to potentially CGC either that or it's going to be a second a separate offering I'm not sure I saw some message anyways uh, so let's get into it simple it's a box we open it up patow here we are oh look at that um, we get the slabbed book on top we get information about who our signer is or we have artist Frank Cho uh, signing, uh, known for his work there on Harley Quinn and Wonder Woman. And sure enough, we have <clears throat> Wonder Woman. Let's pull this out here of the plastic. The Wonder Woman Black and Gold issue number one, Frank Cho, signed by Frank Cho in a 9.8. So this is uh, the series. D DC's been doing these. Uh, the Wonder Woman Black and Gold, the Superman Red and Blue, the Bla B Batman Black and White. These two-color um, kind of uh, comics, which have been uh, pretty cool. Some interesting stories on them. So issue one, Wonder Woman Black and Gold, Fra signed by Frank Cho. And then underneath where the, where the slab was... That's where then we get down into here, and we have our raw copy of the same book, so you can read it, and our comic mount. And now this comic mount can be used either on um, the wall like this, or you can use it as a stand, as you kind of see here off to the side, um, <clears throat> to, as a freestanding stand. So it's a that's a multi-purpose display. Uh, piece that's there. So there you guys go. Um, leave a message, comment down below. Let me know what you think uh, about the box so far. Like I said, I've, I continue to be pretty happy with it. Um, and uh, so we'll keep it going for another month. Oh, this was the New York City Comic Con 2021 exclusive variant. So we now have the New York City Comic Con exclusive variant before the New York City Comic Con actually even occurs. So there you are. Until next time, guys, collect what you want. Don't listen to anybody, including myself, because I'm just a fat man with a fat stack of comics and a fat opinion. Thanks for watching.